do do to today's video i want to turn it with a quick impromptu video in today's video i just want to talk about um 3d capturing of the soul yes 3d capturing of the soul right so like different shit like uh like like cameras and shit like that tvs motherfucking um Like just other shit like uh like phones, radios and stuff like that. That's like three D capturing and shit like that. Like it take bits and pieces of your soul. So do video games do too. And I fuck with video games, so I'm not just saying that just to say it. You know what I'm saying? Like it take like bits and pieces of your soul and shit like that. And you become like fragmented and you start to become like basically like programmed like on the cyborg level, but it's like on like a spiritual, virtual kind of level, you know what I'm saying? If that makes sense, because they take bits and pieces of your soul through technology. And actually, R. L. Stein, the uh, creator of Goosebumps, he actually did a a book about that in an episode where they talk about how you take pictures of the camera, like the camera take pictures of you, and like steal pieces of their soul, but whatever it captures, like in the picture, it's like that's what they become in real life. It's like some freaky like paranormal shit but that's real though you see what i'm saying and it's just about me even recording this video and shit they watch it through the lens you know what i'm saying who the nsa alphabet boys you see what i'm saying and any other weird spangled and shit that's going on real shit and another thing i want to touch on too is uh the Brittany grinder shit like people took what i said the wrong way like i'm glad that she's free i'm glad that she has a freedom but i'm saying that the media the media they're going to take her specific situation, whether she's in on it or not, which I know she's not. And they're going to push it out there as a distraction. Same thing with the Kanye West comments. The same thing with the stuff with Kyrie Irving. Shout out Kyrie Irving. Shout out Kanye West. Shout out Brittany Garner. You know what I'm saying? With all those people, they're going to use that shit as a distraction. The same thing with T.I. snitching and all that. They're going to use that as a distraction. I'm not saying those people are doing it deliberately, but the media... It's going to take that and use it as a distraction. You see what I'm saying? To keep people. And another thing, too, what they doing. Same thing with, like, Russia and all that shit. The Britney Griner shit, that was a psyop. She just got caught in the wrong place, wrong time type shit. I'm not sure if she had a game out there or some type of summer camp or something like that. Or she probably was just traveling out there or whatever. But... That's what Russia gonna start doing. They're gonna start coming in here, sending spies in America, which they already got spies out here, and start capturing people as prisoners, political prisoners, and taking them back to Russia and hold them hostage. That way, America can come to Russia, and now America is fighting Russia now in World War Three. Like America's already like helping Ukraine fight them, but that's kind of like Ukraine. Russia type of fight is like a bloodline type thing, but if they capture hostages from America and other countries, then them other countries gotta come in, and now it's a World War Three. You, you see what I'm saying? So they get you prepared for what the fuck going on. The same thing, the kind of like clothing line and shit like that. I forgot what the clothing line called. Um, I think it's called Yeezys too. I'm not sure, but with the holes in it and stuff like that, that's the type of stuff people gonna be wearing because it's gonna be warfare going on spiritual warfare political warfare physical warfare emotional warfare financial warfare you know inflation all that type of shit you see what i'm saying recessions all that type of shit so it's like it's a lot of different shit going on i was, I was singling out Brittany grinder i wasn't saying that i'm glad she got her freedom like come on like she one of the dopest uh wnba players out there you see what i'm saying but i'm just saying like all this shit, they using it as a psyop, whether these people is in on it or not. I'm telling you real shit. Real shit. And watch things about to start getting more and more spangooly. They already is. Mark my words, you will see. Wake the damn up. More videos coming soon. Damn. Feel what I'm saying?